It's been a long year of pain, suffering, and hard work from our essential workers. Well, today, we celebrate them. New York City full of smiles, sounds, and color as the ticker tape parade honored essential workers who helped the city through one of its toughest times, the COVID-19 pandemic. News 12 reporter Phil Tate was there all day and tells us more from outside City Hall. We woke up every day and did our job to help those in need. <laughs> And today, our city lining the streets on Broadway, cheering for essential workers from Battery Park to City Hall to simply say thank you. Thank you to the doctors. Thank you to the technicians. Everybody who makes the hospitals work in this crisis, you are our heroes. Thank you. The Hometown Heroes Parade honoring those who stood on the front lines for over a year. Everyone from bodega workers, postal workers to New York City's finest. Well, you nailed it. Canyon Heroes. That's what all these essential workers are. That's what men and women of the department are about. And amid scorching temperatures, 10 marching bands sounded off. For the unsung heroes, 14 floats and confetti pouring over New York City streets, creating cheer. Excited representing my daughter, Des Tresia Matos from Northwell. She's working today, so she couldn't be here. Onlooker saying it's a start to the city's big comeback. As some cried, others cheering that New York City is back, leaving essential workers with this feeling. I feel awesome. This is the greatest day of my life. Outside City Hall, Phil Tate, News 12. And great coverage from our team, Phil. And if you want to see more from today's Hometown Heroes Parade, head to our website, news12.com, and click on Photos section. You'll be able to find some behind-the-scenes photos saluting our hometown heroes.